Dell has agreed to buy Perot Systems for nearly $4 billion, sending Perot shares soaring. Michelle, tell us what's going on. Dell says that it will offer $30 per share in cash for Perot Systems, says Lunda. And yes, Perot Systems owned by the former presidential candidate, Ross Perot. Now, that offer is more than 68% Perot's closing price on Friday. Dell's shares closed down 4% today. Perot shares soaring, closing up 65%. Now, we did some data digging, and we found something very interesting. Trading in bullish Perot options jumped to a seven-year high on September 18th. That's the Friday before Dell announced the deal. Now, call options, as as you know, convey the right to buy a stock at a specified price by a certain date. So they're used if you're long in the stock, you think the price will go up. Now on September 18th, call volume climbed to 242 times the four-week average. And this is a big surge in activity and it could indicate some insider trading. Some of the biggest insider trading cases have focused on purchases of options before acquisitions were made known. When there's a volume spike on a legitimate takeover, it smacks of insider trading. So says Steve Soshnik, he's the equity risk manager at Interactive Brokers Group. And the real question is, why did people wake up on Friday morning and decide to make big bets in upside calls on Perot? Maybe someone got Got wind of the transaction. Now, spokespeople at the SEC and Dell have declined to comment. So, Huss, we don't know if there are going to be any investigations on this matter. Huss? Michelle, I'm guessing Perot will help Dell expand. Tell us more about this deal. Well, you are guessing absolutely right, Haslinda. Perot System is going to help Dell expand its services unit, helping it compete with IBM and Hewlett Packard. Their larger services units helped IBM and HP weather the recession better than Dell that was more dependent on uh, sales. Now, the deal will also expand the pool of potential customers for Dell's computer systems. Now, if you look at Dell's balance sheet, you will see that it has over $11 billion in cash there. And analysts say if it really wants to beef up its enterprise business, that there could be more acquisitions ahead. Huss? And talking about acquisitions, the possible targets, what could they be? Well, analysts over at Sanford Bernstein say Dell may be looking at moving into software and other higher margin hardware categories such as storage. Therefore, possible targets could be Salesforce, ticker CRM, and Commvault, ticker CVLT. Now, some are speculating that computer programs and systems, or CPSI, could be a target. And it hit its 52-week high today, $41.69. Your to date it is up 55%. CPSI is a supplier of healthcare solutions, as is Cerner, another target, and another stock which hit its 52-week high today. So healthcare solutions, possibly interesting targets for, for Dell, and uh, maybe very interesting given the healthcare reform. That's, of course, been the topic du jour these days, Huss. Watch that space. Michelle McCory, thank you.